Top 10 Reasons Why You Should Get a Cavapoo Hey all, in this video you will learn everything about the top 10 reasons why you should get a cavapoo. So make sure you watch till the end. Also, check out the description for more helpful information and if you consider buying a dog. Number 10. Affectionate The cavapoo's most prominent personality attribute is that it is extremely loving. For generations, the cavapoo is thought to have inherited this feature from the Cavalier King Charles Spaniel. The aristocratic and faithful Cavalier King Charles Spaniels were noted for being devoted lapdogs. Cavapoos are excellent companion dogs for folks who want to spend a lot of time with their pouch companions and establish a deep bond with them. For dog enthusiasts, the Cavapoo is a fantastic choice. Cavapoos make excellent pets for families, singles, children, elders and those who live in the city or the country. Most owners report that these dogs provide them with unconditional love. And who wouldn't want that in a pet? Number 9. Low Shedding The Cavapoo is marketed as a hypoallergenic dog. Yet there is no such thing as a hypoallergenic dog due to its low shedding coats. People who assume they are allergenic to a pet's fur are actually allergic to dander or dandruff according to the American Kennel Club AKC. The Cavapoo inherits the Poodle's parents' reduced shedding characteristics. The Poodle is one of the top purebreds noted for being an excellent fit for allergy sufferers. There's no way of knowing if the Cavapoo will acquire these desirable Poodle genes, but if it does, the Cavapoo will be ideal for people who suffer from allergies and respiratory problems. As a precaution, if you suffer from allergies, you should spend time with a Cavapoo before purchasing to ensure that it is the right fit for you. Number 8. Eager to Please It's only natural that the Cavapoo would be eager to please, given that it's bred to be devoted and exhibit unconditional affection to its owner. The Cavapoo tries to please its owner and will do anything that is requested of them. This is one of the characteristics that allows the Cavapoo to learn a variety of tricks and become highly friendly with strangers. It also inherited the Cavalier King Charles Spaniel breed's drive to please. Dogs are loyal to their owners because they provide them with food and shelter, according to science, but the Cavapoo's loyalty is defined by unconditional love. Number 7. Good for nice owners there are some dogs that are simply better for first-time dog owners than others. These dogs are trainable and easygoing, but canines who are particularly sensitive, independent, thoughtful or assertive may be more difficult for a first-time dog parent to handle. The Cavapoo represents all of the qualities that a first-time dog owner would wish. Its charming nature, Eagerness to please and low shedding coats make them an excellent choice for individuals with limited experience. Being a first time dog owner can be difficult, so think carefully about whether you have the right mix of circumstances before contacting a breeder or rescue organization. Number 6. Sociable These sweet dogs are extremely sociable. When your friends come around, you don't have to worry about putting them in another room because these dogs adore everyone. Because of its friendliness and loyalty, the Cavapoo is a wonderful choice for families with children. They also get along well with other animals and dogs because they are quite sociable. They're also fantastic therapy and emotional support dogs for seniors. Number 5. Highly intelligent and easy to train because the Cavapoo inherited its intellect from the Poodle, it is a highly intelligent dog. The Cavalier King Charles Spaniel is undoubtedly bright, but the Poodle ranks second among the 195 breeds approved by the American Kennel Club. So there's no comparison because the Cavapoo is a highly clever creature who is eager to please. When it comes to dog training though, it can be intimidating since the truth is that training your dog is a very large endeavor. Owning a Cavapoo makes dog training easier and some owners even claim that this crossbreed makes training more fun. Positive reinforcement as opposed to negative reinforcement is swiftly rewarded by the Cavapoo. 
Positive reinforcement refers to the addition of something, such as a reward, shortly after a behavior happens in order to increase the frequency of the behavior. When the Kavapu commits a mistake, negative reinforcement is used by scolding or putting it to the crate. Number 4. Sizing A fully mature Kavapu can grow to be 10 to 15 inches tall and weigh anywhere from 15 to 25 pounds. Although the Kavapu will not fit in your pocket, they are readily adept to an apartment. Conditions of life Keep in mind that because the Kavapu is a hybrid breed, the only method to accurately estimate its height is to look at its parent's lineage. Although the Kavapu is not considered a lapdog, it will be able to accompany you wherever you go. Number 3. Temperament The Kavapu's temperament is defined as a wonderful mix of being active and laying low. The Kavapu gets its even balance from its crossbreed with the Poodle's activeness and the Cavalier King Charles Spaniel's tranquility. The temperament of a Kavapu is mostly determined by its parents, socialization and the environment it is in. The Kavapu's disposition will be friendly, warm and appealing. But if you do not make an effort to give your Kavapu time and attention, the dog may become aloof and withdrawn. Number 2. Relatively Healthy The Kavapu is one of the healthiest hybrid poodle dogs on the market. As a hybrid dog, the Kavapu has a lifespan of 10 to 15 years. Although some of the health risks associated with the Cavalier and Poodle breeds can be avoided, even if the Kavapu's parents are well-bred and come from excellent lineage, the Kavapu may still suffer from a variety of medical issues. Purchasing from a trustworthy breeder may help reduce health risks, but we'll get into that later. Number 1. Variety of Colors one of the most exciting aspects of the Kavapu is that it comes in a range of colors to match their parents' personalities. The Cavaliers are only available in four colors, chestnut and white, black, white, tan, and ruby. The Poodle comes in a variety of hues and designs, providing the Kavapu with a wide range of color that everyone enjoys. The Kavapu is available in two patterns, solid and party colored, also known as tricolor. Solid hues include black, red, apricot, black, and tan. The Kavapu in the party color has a white body with colored dots. However, any solid color can be used in the party pattern. So what do you think? Let us know in the comments and share your experience with other interested dog owners. Also check out the description for more helpful information and if you consider buying a dog. And if you found this video helpful, it would be great if you subscribe to our channel so you don't miss new videos and learn new things.